October 18th, the key to the missionary's devotion. They went forth for his name's sake. 3 John chapter 7. Our Lord told us how our love for him is to exhibit itself when he asked, Do you love me? John 21 verse 17. And then he said, Feed my sheep. In effect, he said, Identify yourself with my interests in other people, not identify me with your interests in other people. 1 Corinthians 13 verses 4 through 8 shows us the characteristics of this love. It is actually the love of God expressing itself. The true test of my love for Jesus is a very practical one, and all the rest is sentimental talk. Faithfulness to Jesus Christ is the supernatural work of redemption that has been performed in me by the Holy Spirit. The love of God has been poured out in our hearts by the Holy Spirit, Romans 5 verse 5, and it is that love in me that effectively works through me and comes in contact with everyone I meet. I remain faithful to His name even though the common sense view of my life may seemingly deny that and may appear to be declaring that he has no more power than the morning mist. The key to the missionary's devotion is that he is attached to nothing and to no one except our Lord himself. It does not mean simply being detached from the external things surrounding us. Our Lord was amazingly in touch with the ordinary things of life, but he had an inner detachment except toward God. External detachment is often an actual indication of a secret, growing inner attachment to the things we stay away from externally. The duty of a faithful missionary is to concentrate on keeping his soul completely and continually open to the nature of the Lord Jesus Christ. The men and women our Lord sends out on his endeavors are ordinary human people, but people who are controlled by their devotion to him, which has been brought about through the work of the Holy Spirit.